Hey everyone, I am Brittany with the Cosmic Lunar Soul and as you can see I am in a different space today. I am outside. So if you hear some um, if you hear some noises from outside, that is why. <laughs> Alright, so I got my Witch's Moon box on time this month. Uh, that's very exciting. This is the middle tier Witch's Moon box. Again, as a reminder, there are three tiers. The bottom one is the Witch's Roots. The top one is the Witch's Bounty, and this one, the middle tier, is the Witch's Moon. Let's get into the box opening. We are going to start with the Oracle card, and this one is Victory. That's actually really cool. Um, it says, I shall celebrate and I shall rise. I will let victory make me wise. That's great. Here is the information page, so you can see here all of the information. So this is the first spell card we've gotten in a while, it's I Wish Upon, and it's just a really cool piece of grimoire art. Oh, and we have two big things of grimoire art. This is Spirits of Fate which is just so beautifully illustrated as all the art is. And this is to weave a wish. I think this is really appropriate and very timely. Tomorrow is the new moon, so this is a great time for wishes and manifestation. All right, let's get into the box. So I found our herbs. Let's see what herbs we have this month. We have St. John's wort, blue corn flower, and black cohosh. This one actually is new to me. I've gotten this before and this before um, in previous boxes, but I do use both. So it's perfect time for a restock. This is very interesting. I will have to look into that. If you use black cohosh, comment below. Let me know what you use it for. Okay, here's our bath salt. This is Beltane Blessings. And you know what time it is. Smell test. But first, let's look at that. That's really beautiful. This is actually more fine of a salt, a bath salt, than we've gotten in the past. So I'm going to do my... Britney smell test. Oh my gosh, this is amazing. So this one's a little messy, but that's, it's okay. You know, things shift around in transport, so I understand. Um, but this smells like just very refreshing. Um, it has a little bit of like a citrusy smell to it. Almost maybe bergamot and some florals. I can't identify them all, but I really like this one. They've been really hitting this out of the park lately with these bath salts. Okay, this is our crystal. Let's open it up. This is a piece of Argonite. And it's just really cool. I love the ge geometry of it. And it's just very unique looking. Here is our candle. Let me get this open and I will be right back. This is just a simple purple candle. Um, I've noticed lately the candles have been pretty plain. I actually don't mind that so much. Um, I'm, especially when they come with like glitter. I'm not really a fan of that personally. So I enjoy a nice plain candle. All right, have you seen this box enough? You know this is our oil. Let me open this up and see what we got. So this is called the Weaver. And look at that, all those beautiful herbs floating in there. Let's uh, open it up and see what, what it smells like. So this actually smells sort of uh, like food. I don't know how to explain it, actually. Um, it actually smells good. It's a nice light scent. It's not as strong as some of the previous oils have been. So I actually really like this. I'll have to read more on it and see how I want to use it. Okay, I'm gonna dig around here so we'll see what's in this packet. I think this is our incense. 
manifest just in time for the full moon. This box is just perfectly timed this month. All right, you know what time it is? Smell test time. So this is nice and earthy and musty and it kind of actually reminds me of like what you would think of when you think of like grandmom's house and I just love this. It is sort of nostalgic even though I know no one in my family has ever burned something that smells like this but I really love this. I'll probably go through this so quickly. All right, I think that is all of the small stuff. So let's get into this big stuff here. Oh my goodness. You guys, I've been wanting a wooden bowl for my, um, for my bone readings for forever. And I just refused to commit on getting one. And look, I finally got one. Manifest it in time for the full moon. I'm gonna sit this here because I think these go together. I kind of wish they had wrapped this up because of all of this here and you can see it got some of the bath salt stuff on it, but it's not the end of the world. Okay, this, this is a tapestry and it's huge. It doesn't fit in the frame of the camera, but look at that. That's so beautiful and I can't wait to hang it up. Hey everyone this is editing Brittany. I realized that my camera battery died on me so I didn't get a chance to do my wrap up. Well we're just going to do the wrap up now. Check out this photo. Let me know what your favorite thing is. As always I say you cannot choose the big item so you can't choose the tapestry. So for me I think my favorite thing is a toss up between the grimoire art and the bowl. The bowl is something that I've been wanting for a while and it manifested itself in this box for me. But the grimoire art is beautiful and it's been a really, really long time since I've just been so excited to add the grimoire art to my actual book of shadows for any other reason other than it's pretty. So comment below, let me know what your favorite thing was. Make sure you like this video, subscribe and click that notification bell so you don't miss out on any future videos. Bye guys.